Try Bowser. Try Bowser is actually kicking our ass, guys. <gasps> are you kidding me? All right, so. Hello ladies and gentlemen, how are you all doing today and welcome back to Zombies Archives and today we are back on Mario Kart Wii Deluxe and this time as you can see it's not blue but red, that's right what I said, this uh, version of the game or this game actually has four versions of, uh, versions of itself. We played the blue version last time and now we're gonna take a look at the red version and I just needed to change one setting, I actually set this to choose, I actually want to get get this back in order so we can actually have a proper feel of having the Grand Prix and as you can see this is the big biggest difference of this version compared to the blue one first of all carts are back to normal from what I've been able to see so um, no changes there but um, what is different is that every single character has a bit of a costume on for some reason uh, Funky Kong is the most notorious one as it's being a link lover I have no idea why and Bowser is Pretty fancy looking, if I if I would uh, say so myself. But uh, for today, um, I'm going for Yoshi with his cowboy hat and his gloves for some reason. I wonder how great that actually controls with uh, with a car. But anyway, we're playing the SNES Flower Cup today, meaning well the next four tracks for this, and uh, yeah, we'll see what's gonna happen. We get the Mario Circuit original uh, version of Mario Circuit 2 SNES, which is nice. I actually, when I practiced this, got the uh, remake. Just like with last time, every single track um, also tends to have a uh, remake of itself, like two versions. So we're going to try and cover both of them at this video. So it's going to be a long one uh, today again. And uh, yeah, I kind of sum up Misty Item Box, that's kind of annoying. But uh, at, the, at the very least, that means we're going to ha have to be uh, trying our best here and uh, really test our uh, skills. Because uh, remember like last time, like I kind of want to be challenged. Birdo is already in our side, which is kind of funny. Because she do be our darling uh, when it comes to uh, us being Yoshi. Yeah, I felt like Yoshi was kind of jealous that we didn't pick him last time. So I felt like uh, he deserved to uh, get a chance. Because uh, like as, as, I, as I said last time, uh, I want original characters in the sense that like in this game, in this original game... Oh god, there were specific characters introduced to it. There's one character we cannot pick from that game. And it kind of sounds very stupid, but that is actually like as hardcore as I'm going with these rules. Donkey Kong. It's not Donkey Kong, it's Donkey Kong Jr. Meaning, we cannot pick Donkey Kong for this for these games' this tracks. Even though it, 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 it's... it's basically the replacement and no Donkey Kong Jr. is also not Diddy Kong they're two completely isolated characters from each other and I believe the last time we have seen Donkey Kong Jr. is actually in Super Mario Kart if I remember correctly so yeah he just got cancelled out he uh, Donkey Kong just need, needed better friends and uh, so along came Diddy and uh, the DK crew yeah he just completely got the uh, yeah I don't even know so uh, yeah Rip to the DK Jr. If for some reason there was actually like a costume that allowed us to play as him. I would have, but uh, yeah, no. There's no, uh, there's no way for that uh, happening. And uh, in this, and uh, that believe we're actually gonna have to. What the fuck? Okay, so basically to put it very straight up, the last time that I actually went things in order, I actually just kind of went lucky, got really lucky. With uh, it being the first cup in the first four courses. Because that's kind of just a glitch in the game. Or I guess in the system. Where in order kind of works. But it will after the first track you've played just follow the original order. So it will go to the second track. And I believe actually if you like go to uh, yeah, do things afterwards. It's actually like I don't even know. Like go back to uh, oh god. I'll just focus on the race right now, alright? So, Choco Island, I believe this is the original? Yeah, it, it looks very much like a remake, but it's not the case. And also, yeah, we're gonna have to do like a versus Grand Prix of like three races now. Can't win them all, I guess. But uh, what, uh, what the hell ever. This is why I feel like uh, Yoshi is a good choice with his uh, cowboy head and everything for this version. Because uh, as you might be able to guess, uh, basically every version is going to have something else for us in store when it comes to either characters or vehicles. I was pretty lucky. I don't even know why I did not feel anything of that, but okay, it is what it is. We have to, we have to move on. We, there's a lot of mushrooms here. 
That was perfectly placed. And we're already down to the fifth lap. In Shoko Island. Let's go. We got some uh, bananas. We got some uh, more bananas. Even though uh, we cannot even pick Do Donkey Kong for them. But it is what it is, man. Donkey Kong is still in the game. And he even brought his uh, friends, even including one of the best characters in Mario Kart, which only happens to appear here. But hey, he's even playing as Link right now. More, what more can I say? On to the next track! People that might know their Mario Kart, and Mario Kart Wii and Super Mario Kart know that this is Ghost Valley number 2, this next track. And that this track is actually already a Mario Kart Wii. So what I did for actually making this still somewhat uh, deluxe instead is make it 5 laps and throw an HD texture over it. So it's it's not really a different layout, they don't really need to do that. I believe this is also the original soundtrack for it completely, so there's not even uh, a change there. But uh, there is actually like another version, I'll get on I'll get onto that when we actually get there, but uh, yeah. It's pretty interesting to see it like this. It's really very vanilla-ly changed, I would say. Like, only the texture for the floor is different. And I guess there are five laps instead of three, but it's really not that big a difference. Also, yeah, I've played this track so many times because Mario Kart Wii is hands down the Mario Kart that I've played the most out of every single Mario Kart. I do tend to, like, like Mario Kart 8 a lot more not more than Mario Kart Wii but just more in general than I did at the beginning I just kind of had a honeymoon phase of Mario Kart 8 at first for like a week or two and then just grew out of it when I b beat all the Grand Prix and then really like I just didn't feel like playing it too much because I felt like especially when the deluxe version came out it was like yeah bro it's the same game <laughs> just with a battle mode oh god oh god I'm surprised I'm still first. I'm surprised I'm still first. Who's who's behind me? Who's second? Oh god. Okay, that works, that works, that's fine. We got a banana. I will say, this cup so far has been very easy on me, even though I've put the... I swear I've put the AI on the hardest difficulty. Don't really know what's up with that. But anyway, we made it to the end of this track and this uh, race, and uh, we're very likely uh, to... Uh, Actually, I think we already got this in the bag, somewhat. Well, not entirely, but the AI is doing very poorly. Anyway, onto the last track. The last track for uh, this Grand Prix. Because afterwards, well, you guys know what's going to happen. We're going to have to check out the other versions. And wow, this remake is amazing. That is actually... I'm surprised it's not, again, like a Super Mario World ripoff from World 1. Because I was kind of afraid that they were going to do that for every single track, but I'm very pleasantly surprised with how it looks. It's the... It's even a different remix from the first one. Ah! Okay, the, the layout is a little bit tricky. It's kind of one trade-off from everything, but hey, we gotta have to work with it. What is this remix, man? This remix is hitting hard! This remix is hitting real hard, ladies and gentlemen. It's very relaxing. Not sure if that actually fits with this uh, track, but... I will say it's a good thing this is only three laps, because it's quite on the lengthy side. I think that's what the, the creator is actually uh, determ determining the amount of laps on. If it's short enough, it will stay true to, to the original lap count. But if it's just too long, like this for example, like 30 seconds for a lap... Imagine having to do five five laps of that. That would be kind of boring. Because I can appreciate it for what it is, especially with how nice it is remade and everything. Like I'm, off. I'm having an awful lot of enjoyment from this. But at the end of the day, it's still an SNES track, and you can only really have that much of SNES before it starts to become dull. So like, yeah, again, like a minute and a half per track. I can handle. I think that's what an average person can handle. But like, eventually, you will want to have to. You will want to move on to uh, greater things. So I can see why he's doing this. But uh, yeah, I'm still awfully impressed with how the how the tracks play and feel so far, man. 
Perfect score, even though uh, I kind of had to restart a moment ago, but it is what it is, man. It really is what it is. So, uh, I'm not even gonna show the ceremony because I feel like th I believe that's the same every time. Well, the music is a little bit different, I guess. But, uh, yeah, not really that noticeable. So, I'll beat you guys back up when I actually uh, go and uh, tackle the remakes, the other versions of the tracks that we still need to cover. So, uh, I'll be right back. And there we go, yes. Okay, so I got the other version of this track first try again. I'm so I don't know how I'm so lucky with this. Like, when I'm not re when I'm not doing this for a recording, like I tend to not be so lucky. So I'm surprised I'm not actually ha having let's play luck. Something that doesn't really happen very often, and I already got bounced off a thing. We got a nice little shortcut thing here, which I want to make use of. Although that wasn't very a very good idea, or I guess not when uh, I'm trying to trick off that. So maybe that's something that I have to keep in mind. Just not trick off that ramp. And just don't die. Wow, okay. The AI is actually making quite a challenge on this version, specifically. It's kind of odd. It wasn't that challenging a moment ago, but okay. Two more laps to go. I am making terrible mistakes. I actually am. Okay, cool. Yeah, okay, got that, got that. AI surely didn't have that. For some reason. That's Luigi. Gold Dry Bowser is ahead. Look at that. I guess... If you just... Maybe because he's like gold and everything. That's like a hint that he actually like has even even more beefed up AI. Come on. Wow. Wow. I guess Dry, ba Dry Bowser is actually kicking our ass, guys. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Funky Kong, you little dipshit. You actually <laughs> bounced me off the bullet bill. What? And now Baby Peach is the MVP or something. I guess because of the bullet bill. Oh, that, that could have been us, guys. That actually could have been us. He's winning. She's winning in the Baby Cruiser? Oh, no, no. She's being a dumb bitch. She's, she's being a dumb... I cannot believe I won that. I can actually not believe... Yeah, oh, by the way, I'm playing this with an Xbox controller. Go, go, go fight me. It's just what I have. It's what I like using. Oh man, let's move on. And yeah, this is obviously with uh, an emulator. There we go, finally! Oh my god, it, for some reason it took seven tries before I got this version. So I hope this run is gonna go well. And otherwise, well, I'll just do this until it actually fails. Because I swear to god, I'm not gonna try an RNG for this again. Wow, this was disgustingly difficult to get, but oh well. So. Yeah, as I said, um, it's a raining version. Ooh, for some reason, I'm going a lot faster than I'm used to. Um, in case you were wondering, why is there no Choco Island one again? Apparently, there is no other version for that specific track. However, in a moment, I've actually looked at the track list. And Donut Plains 2 actually has three versions, not two. So, we still have two tracks to, to go for after this. No, no, no matter what. So yeah, that's interesting to see. I actually did not expect that. Bo both, both uh, Choco Island not having another version. Although I will say Choco Island, I believe, is from all the versions, from all the track like styles. I believe it's the least popular. I believe, especially like uh, 2023, 2023, like uh, that version or that style just really gets used the least like it I feel like it used to be vanilla dome or vanilla lake but uh, like recently they brought that track back in uh, Mario Kart Tour a lot so it got more popularity that way and just yet yeah, Choco Island I don't know I feel like it got released a lot a couple of times which is not enough and also I don't really know how you can remake that again like uh, in a way that is not the way it's like an original remake. Oh, come on. Well, I'm still first at least. And I don't really care, honestly, if I'm gonna be, if I'm not gonna be. Not when it's actually too easy to win. I barely had to do anything there. I, it is, of course, like Mario, a Mario Kart Wii track still originally. So I feel like they, like the AI 
the developer can only really, really improve the AI that much on a track like this, but yeah. So, we still have two versions of Donut Plains to tackle. Hopefully it's gonna be, yeah, it's one of them, nice. And I don't really remember if the other version we need is either the MKT version or a remake version. I feel like it's the MKT version when I think about it because the MKT version is, I think, very uh, similar to how it looks in uh, Mario Kart 8, which is, in my opinion, really just a copy paste of Mario, of Super Mario World Bros uh, for the Wii, World 1, like that aesthetic basically. But yeah, um, yeah, still same track, it's just a normal sound effect uh, this time around. It's just like how we're used to with Donut Plains number one. Just the basic stuff. I don't really like the, the mud here. It's it's nicely done how they actually managed to make that more uh, just a more slippery ground. Because I do not think those physics were actually originally in the game. I guess they simply used the ice physics from uh, Sherbet Land. Don't really care about this to be honest. Luigi is in second. With his uh, builder things. I actually want to be Luigi in one of these... Uh, Original, I feel like. But we might not get the chance to do that when I think about it. Uh, was there a shortcut here somewhere? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, that works. Oh, look at, look at me being fancy. Screw you, Luigi. Hello, Mario. Get hit. He's actually on our tail, dude. Well, not so much anymore. There we go. Just a few seconds to late, pal. But you'll have your chances eventually. I will I have no doubt about that. So, one more version of uh, Donut Plains number two we need to tackle. I'll uh, be right back when we get there. Wow. Okay, my luck turned around. This, I, I, I believe this is actually, is it? Yeah, it is. I don't have those trees anymore. That's the only way I can actually uh, like differentiate it from the actual remake. So yeah, this is Mario Kart Tour, the third version of Donut Plains number two. And uh, I believe after this we'll be able to call the video and uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying the series so far. I really am so far. Oh god. Uh, I believe this is the first time we got this. I kind of wanted to keep that. It just seemed intimidating, but I believe that thing right there is actually going to make us grow and I actually literally got got it a split second too late because he just grew at that very second at that very very frame if we got there wow I'm getting crushed I'm getting actually actually destroyed oh I got a lightning for a return though got it yeah if you get a if you get a banana first it cancels out the boost you're you're getting from a mushroom it's dumb uh, back to fifth that's the good news. Okay, I can try and keep it this time around. And also, if you have this, you can freely move on on, on off road. That's a good trade off for this. Come on, yes, thank you. Now die, die. Also, like in uh, other versions, these musics are different, as you can see, as you can may listen to it. This is actually like the Kirby Infinite Infinite Infinity uh, music. Yeah, the Kirby Infinity music. I'll just I'll just keep it at that anyway. One more lap remaining for uh, Donut Plains number two. Oh, come on. Come on. Don't catch up on me. Do it for the Yoshi, man. Do it for the Yoshi. The Yoshi deserves it. Ah. Okay, come on, come on, come on. We're almost there, dude. Just, a U just two U-turns, man. Got a green shell. Yeah, we got this. We got this. Easy mode, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, with that, we got everything covered for the Flower Cup for the SNES. So, uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed that. If you like what you said, don't forget to drop a thumbs up. If you are more, make sure to subscribe. And as always, I will talk to you guys later.